At the Stars and Stripes Cafe in Quantico, Virginia, the death of three Marines and an apparent murder-suicide is difficult news. Hard to believe that something so close to home really happened, especially on a Marine Corps base where you think it's, you know, nice and safe. Around 10.30 Thursday night, authorities responded to a 911 call at the Quantico base and found a man dead from a gunshot wound in the Taylor Hall barracks. The base went on lockdown. Hours later, police found the body of a woman and the body of the apparent shooter in another part of the barracks. The shooter, an active duty Marine, was pronounced dead of an apparent self-inflicted gunshot wound by law enforcement at the scene. Officials say the two victims and the shooter were all staff members at the officer candidate school here at Quantico. At the Marine Corps League bar, Melody Meyer says this tight-knit military town will be looking for answers. But I think that people are very concerned about it. You know, there's three people, three Marines that are dead right now. The shooting at Quantico is the second tragedy to hit the Corps in less than a week. Monday, seven Marines were killed in an explosion during a training exercise in Nevada. Tara Mergener for CBS News, Quantico, Virginia.